Uh, I figured I'd uh, give Jet Set Willie a go because uh, oh, Shahid Ahmad. Okay, thought it was Matthew Smith. I guess he did the C64, but this program was cracked by the frick. Oh, <clears throat> I've got the original of this. Thanks to the pirate for his fabulous full reset. Is that a euphemism for something? And also thanks to the copy shop. <clears throat> for the colour copies of what of the anti piracy card. Oh god. Yeah, it was two sides of a cassette inlay with I can't remember how many codes that there were on it, but uh, I think Jet Set Willie two had a like it was a bit folding out to about eight times as much. But uh, look out for our next programmes. Oh god. Turbo 64, don't know that one. Catacombs, don't know that one. PC Fuzz, oh, Zim Salabim. Yeah, I vaguely remember that one. Okay, that's a bit odd. So, remember that software piracy is dis is destroying the industry. Right, if you are a pirate, if you make copies of commercial programs for anything other than god this is slow for <coughs> purely backup purposes then you are a thief right this is a bit odd you what kind of mindset is this <laughs> you're not only robbing the author of it yes you are but are uh, rightly his or hers but you are also causing a drop in. No, 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 not not me. You're the. Pl Why don't you stop pirating then? Oh, I'm only fulfilling the need, mate. What? what did, but, but to those of you who do buy, uh, who do buy their programs, as opposed to those of you who do buy their programs legally, <laughs> sounds very well, sir. I give my thanks and ask you to help us in the name of in continuing fight against software piracy, software theft. Theft it is, not just piracy, theft. Thank you for your cooperation. Good night. <laughs> Robocop suddenly turned up. Right, you must guide Willie to... Was this the original text and they just tacked their bit at the beginning on and didn't strip out the stuff about piracy? <laughs> oh my god. Um, anyway, yeah, so that's that. I don't know what classical music this is, but I think this was the first time I was ever listening to classical music. Um, press return. No, oh, fine, okay. Ta-ha, look. Yeah, I th yeah, this being, oh yeah, fine to jump. And yeah, that turns you back that way. And more classical music. But yeah, yeah. yeah. Commodore 64 is all blocky. Um, I think you'll find this looks exactly the same, just as sharp as Spectrum version, only, hey, without colour clash. Or without the speakers screeching away any as well. Uh, I've got to go left and then drop down again. Like, there we go. Yeah, I think if I just kept going, I could just jump over that, but... Uh Sweeping thing going to, no, it only goes that far. Ah, look, there's Maria tapping her foot insanely. The amount of times I tried sneaking past. Right, oh, look, you can't see. Oh, now she can see it. Now, <laughs> so it's purely when you go up into her sight, she. Uh, oh, oh, you can see it now. Down, 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 boy. And she also stops, tap, stops tapping her feet as well. It's a very nice touch. And even though she can't see me now, she knows that I'm up there. So, his bedroom doesn't really look very comfortable though, does it? Um, let's see, can I get down there before that comes back? Yes. The first landing has a chapel off it. Okay. Oh, what was on the left here? It's all those little ones bouncing up and down, isn't there? Nightmare room, yeah. I'm not going to bother trying to go and get that one. 
Now I thought if I just push left you could make it all the way through this in one go, but maybe not. Oh, uh, banyan tree is it? Yes, banyan tree. This is where I'm going to lose lives. <sighs> Don't record it being that problematic, but... Uh, oh yeah, hang on, I can just go up here. Go oh. No, I can't, right. Um, I thought I could... Um, let's go to there, I think. Now let's watch those two bounce up and down for a bit. Um, ah, yeah. No, it's on it. Um, oh yes, they're not little things. They're, they're Maria. You're having nightmares about Maria bouncing all over the place. And by which I don't mean Maria Whitaker. From Barbarian and Barbarian 2. I'll have to do those at some point, won't I? God, Barbarian 2 is... Oh. Barbarian 2 was a bloody mess, wasn't it? Just, it would have been okay if you could control where you were going half the time. Oh, no. Woof. <laughs> Ha 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 it. <laughs> yes, one more go, one more go. Let's... What an absolutely pointless waste of time playing Jet Set Willy Pops. You can kind of see the parents going, video game, waste of bloody time. Yeah, because yeah, let's face it, you are never going to complete Jet Set Willy. And I suppose even if you cheated at it and had internet lives or no collision detection, oh, just no, wasn't going to happen, was it? Not unless you left the machine on for like a week and you kept coming back to it and doing little bits. Because even with infinite lives, you had bits where you could, well, like that last one where I jumped, uh, came on screen and just died repeatedly. You know, one wrong step somewhere, and even if you collected 99 of I don't know how many objects they were. Were there a hundred? But these are cool. I like these ones. And the pretty vibrant rainbow glasses and bottles on the table. That was pretty. Uh, and dancing rabbit spinning round on his way back. And. Can I. Oh, oh there, it forces you, right, okay. But yeah, you could, like, collect most of them and then you'd be stuck. Or there's no way back from some places. Uh, uh, right, I can't actually get under him. He doesn't actually go low enough for me to get under. Uh, so we go up. And avoid the barrel. Now, I don't know whether I should be on the next level up on this bit, but we shall... Ah, right, that's okay. Isn't there another thing that comes shooting out of somewhere? Ah, uh, damn. to play laser cat at some point. I haven't played laser cat, have I? On here, on video, I mean. I know I've played laser cat. Like Jet Set Willy, grew up with Jet Set Willy, that sort of thing. Then, uh, yeah, get laser cat on Xbox 360. And I think possibly on PC. Because that's fun, that's Jet Set Willy, but with all the frustrations I end out from it. And it has a sense of humour as well. Great little game. Well worth it. That has my suit of approval. No, I don't want to be going that way, do I? Because that just leads you into... Yeah, see, what, see, even if you had infinite lives, doesn't help you here, does it, on the entrance to Hades? Oh, the amount of times people at school go, Oh, I, I got past entrance of Hades, you've got to drop down a different way. And then you jump across the letters and you drop down to the next level and then you are in Hades. Like, no, nah, yeah, yeah. All these stories, like, people get into the background in um, Battle Zone. I might as well pick that up, just so I've got something collected, even though it's a pointless exercise. Let's see if I can find my way to the freezer room, shall we? Uh, dee -dee 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 -dee. And... Oh, damn it. 
many times have you meant to go, oh, I'm just going to cross the... Oh, I've ended up on the stairs. Whoops. Now, cold store on the left, is it? Um, yeah, let's just go down this place. Nope. Nope. Oh, back to the upstairs. Oh, I keep going up the stairs. Oh, for heaven's sake, Willie. There we go. Oh, you. Mm. Gotcha. Right. Um, I can't remember now. Um, yeah, I've got to be careful or I'll hit that. A giant pear or avocado, is it? That looks like the green snake thing on the level 12, is it? Beam Rider, the one that comes, yeah. The kitchen. Right. I think I want to be on this one up here. And not one of the higher low ones. And <clears throat> oh. No, I don't think I wanted to bother, did I? <laughs> um, let's go across here. Is it the cold store next? It's a cold store, or freezer, or what do they call it? I guess we shall find out shortly if I'm thinking of the right place. Cold store. Ah, and here we have a physics puzzle. Ooh. Yeah, and if I go up from here, I'm in the pool. Oh, God, that was a bit close, wasn't it? Uh, ooh, watch the stars of ice. Yeah, I can't quite get that. Um, <coughs> uh, wait for that penguin on the bottom to stop. Penguins and ice creams. Oh, damn it. His ankles are now in his throat. Wait, there we go. I feel like in the pit of your stomach then. It always confused me how he how to get yourself up and down from this. It changed direction every time. You push left and find yourself going up. So you go, you push right and you go up again. Oh help! Right. Back stairway now. So it's garden shed is it and things below us. Um, I'd never make a tour guide, would I? The wine cellar and the tool shed. There we go. <laughs> Who'd have thought all those years ago when I was playing this for the first time that I'd ever have my own tool shed? Well, I've got a shed that I've got tools in. Anyway. Uh, and I've got a shed that I've got feed in. Uh, wine cellar. Oh, yeah, and the, oh, where does that come out in the world? Yeah, was, was Tool Shed one that's impossible? You know, if you drop down there, and then it sends you over to the right, and then you can probably jump up and get out that way. Um, but was it the wine cellar is impossible? I can't remember. Once you go in there, you can't get out. But there's that bit on the right that takes you Oh, I don't know. Um, I'm not going to go and bother with the Tool Shed. Uh, uh. Yeah, why would you have that? I suppose it gets rid of... People trying to sell at the door. Oh, actually, let's have a look up to the top. I can't remember what's up here now. Watch out for that giant fruit pastel. Whoa! And that. Uh, is there a gunshot across here as well? Nope. Okay. West Wing roof. Orangery. Where was we must perform a quirk of flea? Hmm. Which was apparently by Furry Freak Brothers. Um, under the roof. Look, I'm playing Noman Looney. Yeah, um, can't remember what that meant now. Um, I'm not going to go. Oh, look, that's possibly the ban top of the banyan tree. Down. Oh, damn. Oh, bloody hell. Yeah, that, that was intentional. I meant to do that. Um, hey, look, I could jump left here, couldn't I, if I was feeling suicidal? <clears throat> oh, gunshots as well, marvellous. Oh, what am I doing? <sighs> and oh no, don't sound stuck here like this. No. Damn you. See, you don't have this trouble with laser cap. I just want to jump through the bloody stairs.
there we go. Let's see what's over over the west wing over there. Right, and watch out for that chandelier there. Oh, balls. Definitely getting a Cauldron 2 vibe from this this bit of it anyway. Surely not just the chandelier and the stairs. There we go. Um, west bedroom obviously has razor blades and jelly. Perfect sense. And above the west bedroom. And I can't. Oh, can I just. Probably not. No. Can I do. Oh, nice! So you try and jump through it there and it kills you. That one bouncing up and down there with a the fork looks like the bad guy from Dynamite Down. Professor Watts' his face. Ah. Ha <laughs> um, And what was over here again? Ah, uh, no, there's shots and all sorts. Um, let's see if we can get down this way. And, and poop. I'm assuming I don't want to drop down. I'm assuming I want to go onto those little steps there. Oh, what was I doing there? <sighs> now, do I drop left or right? Let's go left. You fuckers. And so ends yet another game of Jet Set Willy, as they so often do. Yeah, uh, hey, this was another game I bought in Boots, but Boots in Cardiff. It was this for seven ninety five, and I got BMX Racers for one ninety nine, and that was my ten pounds that I spent at Christmas on computer games, on my first computer games. It had to be Jet Set Willy. It was the game everyone was raving about, so that was the thing. Uh, it is really odd going back to it now and hmm but it's still not of a particularly great game is it <laughs> but as a child you were exploring this strange mansion with these strange beasts and you didn't get half the drug and booze references uh, hmm fun to go back to but that's it, I think, with Jet Set Willy. Uh, there's something announced today that um, Matthew Smith's doing something to do with Jet Set Willy with Elite Software, I think. Don't really know what to think about that. Uh, the picture looks like it's got a lot of odd bits and pieces. It's like it's got a picture of a Spectrum on it with a Bluetooth logo. And I was like, um, I worry it's just going to be a bit of a mess. But, uh, oh well, we shall see. Uh, Anyway, yeah, there we go. Jet Set Willy. Hope you enjoyed. Thanks for watching.